just so you know, so you can best plan. And now, Jimbo, we're going to chat. This is Professor Jimbo, actually. This isn't Jimbo. This is <laughs> Professor Jimbo because, you know, you always bring in, you know, you bring the knowledge. Well, I keep myself entertained. I think that's <laughs> my important uh, thing. You keep yourself entertained. You entertain me when you come in here. You entertain the crew. You, just, you know, I never know what you're going to say, and it's always really fun. Yeah, well, you know, I was thinking, uh, what would be one thing that everyone could benefit from for the sport of skiing that would make them a better skier mm -hmm. or better uh, rider if you're on a snowboard? And it always comes down to uh, what's underfoot, the foundation. Mm -hmm. And you know what, what comes in, uh, in most boots, this is a liner from a boot. If you uh, reach inside the liner, here's a little insole from the, the manufacturers. Every manufacturer uh, has uh, Fisher and Solomon and Head, Dalbello, Rosignol. They all have the same thing in there. An They're insole kind of that looks like a foot shape, but it's really a fairly it's like floppy piece of uh, nothing, you know? Right, okay. So uh, if you remove that from the boot and put in something that's a little bit better, uh, price wise, it, it is about 40 or $50 at the at the low end for a, for a stock uh, trim to fit uh, insole like this. Okay. Or you could get a, uh, a custom insole that's a, a match perfectly to your footprint for about $130. So I it's, see. It's a great way to upgrade, uh, upgrade your boots and your fit and improve your skiing. You and know, the, it's affordable, like you said. It's yeah, like it's yeah. not a big deal. The one thing that we all have in common as different as we all are, mm -hmm. inside uh, your foot, we've got like about 26 little tiny chicken See, bones. told you, know? you, Professor Jimbo, 26 <laughs> bones in your foot. I did not know that. Yeah, and Can you name all of them? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> Just thought I would try for a yeah. pop quiz. But you know, the, the, the idea is there's, there's uh, very little tiny bones with string and springs and uh, uh, right. little tiny pieces Connectors. of nothing inside mm -hmm. your foot. And that supports our whole weight and our activity uh, energy while we're skiing. So, so feet are uh, important is what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, feet are very important. And, mm -hmm. uh, you know, at the end of the day, your feet can feel fatigued. Mm -hmm. Also, uh, maybe you don't ski quite in the control that you could possibly with, uh, with an improvement here. So, uh, you know, by getting an insole that, that goes right under your foot, you know, it supports uh, your arch primarily. And, right. uh you know, you can see on the bottom of this insole, there's some hard material there, the art shape, and then right underneath your heel bone, it gathers all that fatty tissue that's right on the bottom of your foot. Okay. It gives you some good shock absorption. Oh, So right. the insole can do, uh, can do a lot of things. Uh, when this is in your, in your boot, mm -hmm. with that kind of support, you don't need to buckle your boots as tight. So your circulation might be improved. Oh, I like warm feet. That's a great Yeah, thing. yeah. They might not go to sleep. Oh, that's you'll the have... worst. You're like, hello, toes. I need you to fire. Exactly. Uh, you'll have better uh, communication with your ski or snowboard because mm -hmm. you'll have to move less. Okay. Uh, your feet will transmit the energy more quickly and more positively. Mm -hmm. It also tends to make your foot a little bit smaller just by supporting the arts. Really? So if you're uh, starved for room inside your boots, by removing the stock insole and putting in one that has support, it's a great way to, uh, to gain a little room inside the boot. Like I said, this is why we call you the professor, <laughs> because you, you know, we always learn something new. Yeah, there's, there's a lot going on with insoles, and uh, some of the, the new things that are, that are out there, uh, this is an insole uh, uh, compared to uh, our stock insoles, mm -hmm. which they start like this. Okay. We heat them up. Mm -hmm. We make a mold of your foot. Oh, whoa. And then we put material on the bottom oh. to keep the insole stable inside the boot. So that's how that evolves. That's cool. Right, right. Okay. So now we've got some that are covered with wool. This is called a woolly. Nice. And you feel it. It's, you can tell that's oh. going to keep your foot nice yeah. and warm inside. Oh, you got to uh, love wool. I mean, those, yeah. those sheep, they know what they're doing. They sure do. <laughs> and we've also got uh, woolly covers that you can put on top of any oh. any insole. You could take cool. this, okay. add, add a, wood, a woolly cover, mm -hmm. and you have a nice, warm, supportive insole for not very much money. Oh. So there's a lot going on there. Some of the insoles are rigid in mm -hmm. that they don't move. They're designed right. to be in ski boots specifically. Okay. Mm -hmm. Some uh, insoles 
can articulate like this. You can mm -hmm. take them from your ski boots, put them into your daily shoes, cross country golf shoes, shoes, golf shoes, mm -hmm. whatever other sport or uh, that's a great idea activity you like to take up. So, so and then your investment goes even further. Exactly. I like that idea. That's that's a phenomenal. See, this is why I call him Professor Jimbo. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a, there's a lot going on with uh, with insoles and. Uh, um, you know, it, it doesn't take much to uh, to switch out the insole that's in your boot and get something better. And in we're there. showing some video of kind of the, the process with it. And look oh, at that, yeah. you guys you guys do all kinds of things over there in addition to um, helping out with you know uh, footbeds and everything. I mean, sure, we do a lot of boot fitting, tons of ski and snowboard tuning, and uh, we've got a lot of equipment specialists that work at uh, Precision. So uh, if you've got uh, issues with your uh, with your gear, get on in. Perfect. Where exactly are you located? We're on Summit Boulevard, of course, uh, next to a discount carpet mm -hmm. uh, right across from the Walmart complex. All so. right. Good to know. So easy to find. Yep. You can stop by and say hi to Professor Jimbo yourself <laughs> or his helpful staff. They can help you out to, um, you know, improve to go from this to something that's really worth your while and will make things a lot easier for you in skiing and all your other sports. So thanks so much for joining me this morning, thanks Jimbo. Thanks for having me. We'll be back with more Summit Sunrise right after this, folks. And don't forget that Watch and Win prize, two free tickets to Copper. <laughs>